and we're back with more Silent Hill 2. What's going on, everybody? And uh, we are playing on my actual PS2, so that's nice. Because um, thankfully, I know how to convert the saves and stuff, so we we were able to take our save from the emulator we were running on uh, recently, converted it, and it's running off my memory card. So everything should be good. Uh, it's all the same settings. So I think we're set. That would be a more genuine experience. The controls will get even worse. <laughs> so let's see here. Oh yeah, that looks a lot better. I mean, yeah, the emulator is nice because it smooths things out, but I do like to have the game with the slightest bit of pixelation. <laughs> Let's see here. Um, you were already in here? Something is written on it. The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side perhaps may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I am a doctor, not a philosopher, or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us, his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind. But to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he is happy there. So why, I ask myself. Why, in the name of healing him, um, must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? And something else is written by hand. I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key to that box. Okay. Got a key. Purple bull key for something. Which is a weird name for a fucking key. All right. I'm just going to stand there. All right. Let me guess. Oh, is she not coming? Jesus, fuck. She's right there. God damn it, Silent Hill. Fucking bullshit. <laughs> Doesn't even make any fucking sense that she would be right there. Alright. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's see where we're going because we got a lot of ground to cover. That's why last day before yesterday, um, Monday, I decided not to start the hospital because I knew we were going to be in here for a long time. So let's go ahead and do that today. Okay, wait, where was that door to? That was the entrance. I think it was the entrance. Where are you planning to go? But we haven't found Laura yet. Okay. So why you're so fucking concerned? <laughs> Lock is broken, can't open it. Because Silent Hill... There are more broken fucking doors. <laughs> I assume I'm going to end up in the day room. There's just too much. Straight ahead or to the left? Uh, well, that answers my question. That answers my question as well. <laughs> Shit. Lock 
Locker room? Yes. Okay. Hey, locker room open. Oh, Lord, we're gonna... You got the exam room key. Jesus, fuck. So she just teleports into the room with no rhyme or reason. <laughs> that is fucking aggravating. <laughs> Men's locker room, women's, nurse's station. Okay. I guess that's it from in here. Where? This camera would work with me. What's wrong? I just really? proved to myself. Are How you did okay? you pick yourself on a teddy bear? Yeah. What the hell is that? You got a bent needle. Okay. The fact that there's a shotgun mm -hmm. in the nurse's station. Or in the women's locker room. That makes a whole bunch of sense. There's a bag here. There's nothing inside. Okay. <laughs> okay, there's a nurse around here somewhere. There you go. Maria, Maria to contribute to this uh, adventure here. <laughs> okay, nothing. So I guess we're clear here. Just about. Are you worried? That. Okay, can't even go in there at all. Double check on that. Yeah, looks like can't go in there at all. There's just like rooms for decoration. Unless I'm gonna be in here and it's gonna change to like Nightmare World or whatever. And then it'll uh, open up or something. Alright, back to checking doors. <laughs> Can I save? <laughs> There's a typewriter here. I've got no use for this. Wait a minute. What's this? There's a sheet of carbon paper still stuck in the car typewriter. I can still read the imprint left on it. I know it. I know the number of the box. 9176. All right. Making notes. Box 9176. It can't help him anymore. The bottom key doesn't scare me, so nobody can stop who I am. I don't know who I am, is who I am, is who I am, is... Okay. It's like, stop talking. Let's play with this. Okay, so that's done. So at least we got a key for a box somewhere. Where? <laughs> Messed up my search pattern. <laughs> okay. Just come out of here. I can't open M1.
Where's Maria? She didn't magically teleport in. Yep, there she is. <laughs> okay, I think I've got a key. Let's see here. Me round six. Handgun bullets, shotgun. Six? I guess it's a lot more uh, scarce than the first one. Okay. Exam room key. Purple bull key. Lapis eye key. An eye is carved into the top of the key. The iris part is made of a lapis last eye. Okay. Bent needle. All right. in here. Bullets. That's nice. Health drink. I guess that was just kind of a ammo room. You didn't waste any time. <laughs> nah, fuck it. We'll just throw her in there. Oh, hold on. Check out this map again. Then I'll go to the third floor. Oh my god, look at the third floor. Look at all those rooms. S1 through 14. I'm just going to run run along them and just keep smacking X. Across them. This game is nothing but map checking. Uh, But then again, so is Resident Evil. I didn't press that. What? I gotta go all the way back. Wait, where the hell am I? <laughs> oh, okay, so that's the day room. I'll get that later. Where? Good shot. I guess this one has uh, like critical shots, like uh, like Resident Evil One and Two, where every now and then you'll hit a headshot just right off the bat, which is pretty nice. Okay, so here to the right, elevator. Can't use that. Okay, so there's a day room and every floor. Okay, that's where everybody goes to hang out, basically. I may have to go to the basement if this is anything like the first one. We can probably turn on a generator or something. Well, let's do the rest of these first. I doubt this will work, but... Uh... No? Okay. Okay, so we're looking for a key. Let me write that down. Uh, elevator, third floor. All right, there really wasn't much here. We're going to go all the way up, and then we'll go all the way back down. Just in case. It's locked. Okay, cool. All right, going all the way down. I find it hilarious. Like, we're playing this, having a good time, reminiscing on the old stuff. But once I finish streaming, make a VOD, I edit and everything. Once I edit everything for YouTube, I swear to God, I cut out like almost, oh wow. I cut out almost like 15 to 20 minutes, upwards of like a half hour of nothing but running. <laughs> Ooh. 
lady? <laughs> Where is she? I'm sure she's in here somewhere. So stupid. <laughs> Third floor patient wing hall? 7335. I wonder if that's the code. We're gonna try that. Where's this gonna take me? Just back out. Okay, I can go back upstairs. There we go. 7335. Haha. <laughs> Alright, cool. Mark that off. I think I heard something. I hear something gooey. <laughs> Howdy. Wow, he actually like... He actually positions himself and then he fires. that whoa okay all right so I got one box code uh, let's see what if it's this one nine one seven six no okay Okay, cool. So that's done. There's still a lock there. So I wonder if I need the... Uh, let's see here. Because I do have a bent thingy. No? Ah, that Basai key. Okay. Cool. I need that one now. And then... Okay. So there is a box in... Let's see if it marks it or not. It doesn't. So now it's not marking things. Uh, we'll do S14. I'll put it right next to where it says box. So I don't lose track of it. Alright, let's explore the rest of this. This this one is a lot more straightforward. Oh, hey, what's this? Set right on the wall. Luis, I'll take care of you forever. It's my destiny. <laughs> um, I do feel like this one's more straightforward than... One. This one is a fucking mess. <laughs> hey, fancy seeing you here. Ah. All right. Let's go say spot. Give me a second. I'm gonna take a drink. Uh, so once again, I think we're making some pretty damn good progress. But this one is definitely more straightforward than uh, the first game. It, I really feel like this one is just explore the map. It's like, oh, I haven't figured out something? Okay, we'll just go where you haven't been in the map. And so far, that's all and see what I've been doing. Except for like, you know, every now and then. Every now and then, I'll, uh, I'll need a guide. Jeez. <laughs> Wait a minute. <coughs> I'm kind of tired. You're tired? What you got? <laughs> it's just a hangover. She got Excedrin. <laughs> you should rest. Hmm. 
so comfy. I wonder about that. I'm gonna go look for her. For Laura. I'll be back as soon as I can. Well, at least I'll leave her here. <coughs> I'll be okay soon. <coughs> Did you find Laura? I mean, I was aiming for the key. Roof key. Okay. So let's see. She is in S3. Hey, woman didn't even drink anything. She just fucking popped them back. <laughs> Okay, that's all of those. Now well, let's take care of the rest of the doors here. Bench. What is that? Predator blood? What the hell? Something stuck in a drainage pipe. That is a fucking ear. Let's do some more. I can't get it in my hand. I decided to reach it. I had a long, narrow tool of some kind. I don't know, but that looks like predator blood. <laughs> Wrong button. Bent needle. It isn't long enough. God damn it. Um, Can I use the roof key? <laughs> That is so stupid. It's not long enough. So now I need... I have plenty of shit that could reach it. But, you know. James is a fucking buffoon. <laughs> okay, so now I gotta remember there is a... Uh... There's like an ear. <laughs> In the shower room on floor... Three... <laughs> I'm glad I'm taking notes. Should have done this shit when I was a kid. <laughs> okay, so we'll do that. Uh, I guess I'll go to the roof. Sweet lord, I used the roof key. <laughs> so. Ooh, what's this? Block is broken. Of course. I gotta find a giant moth up here too, because if so... It's going to be hilarious. Is this a diary? It is a diary. May 9th, rain. Stared out of the window all day. Peaceful here. Nothing to do. Still not allowed to go outside. May 10th, still raining. Talked with the doctor a little. Would they have saved me if I didn't have a family to feed? I know I'm pathetic, weak. Not everyone can be strong. May 11th, rain again. The meds... Made me feel sick today. If I'm only better when I'm drugged, then who am I anyway? Yeah, good point. May 12th. Rain as usual. I don't want to cause any more trouble for anyone, but I'm a bother either way. Can it really be such a sin to run instead of fight? Some people may say so, but they don't have to live in my shoes. It may be selfish, but it's what I want. It's too hard like this. It's just too hard. May 13th is clear outside. The doctors told me I've been released. I've got to go home. I... Oh, wow. Diary ends here. There are no more entries. What was the diary doing up here? Don't know. Okay, so what the hell is the point of coming to the roof? <laughs> Elevator control room. Son of a bitch. Okay, I mean, there's nothing up here. At all. Oh, hey, bud. So and... What a bastard. <laughs> what? Uh, sure. I mean, my controller is like doing the heartbeat thing, but oh, I'm in the special treatment room now. 
before my own three. Okay. Is my health low? Yes, it is. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess I can actually raise the vibration, because I think it's just for, like, your health. It's broken. It is broken. That's not broken. There's something written on the wall. Turn, turn, turn the numbers. Better not forget them. So I'll write them down here. The other one, my secret name. That said 3434, three, right? Yeah, 3434. 3434. Three, right. Now it's unlocked. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm on the third floor. That box is back on 14th. So I go to run all the way down there. Save while I'm at it. I think it's through here. Far end, I believe. Yeah. Okay, so this has to be the code here. Not 9176, it's 3434. Because that dude's lazy. 3. three four. Okay. Like, can you open it? Please? I guess I still need a key. I wonder if that's the blue, the bull key or whatever the hell it's called. Because he did say my secret name. So, let's see here. It'd be nice if I could figure all this out without a fucking guide. <laughs> yeah! There's a few hairs inside. Are you fucking serious? I did all of this to get a piece of hair to combine with the needle. <laughs> That's weird. I don't like the co combined system in this at all. <laughs> All that shit to get hair. <laughs> I could have done that. I have hair. I have really long hair. <laughs> we would have been done with that puzzle days ago. <laughs> Door on my left. Okay, let's figure this shit out. Okay, this is really weird. I don't like the... That's weird. I don't like that. Just do the Resident Evil version of it. Just hit combine and it just turns it into another item. Lazy ass Konami. <laughs> That's uh... An elevator key. Was it an elevator key? Because it looked like an ear to me. It looked like an ear when I first looked in there. Patient wing elevator is written on the tag. It was... Oh. It was stuck in the bath pipe. Patient wing elevator. Oh, there's a little ear on it. See, I'm not stupid. There is a fucking ear. See? <laughs> Worst keychain ever. Okay, so... Elevator... Saving on real memory cards. Shit is awesome. Okay, now, we're gonna go check this elevator. Uh, just left. 
I mean, left. If this fucking game... <laughs> Cool. All right. Let's see what we got here. One, two, one. Door closed. What? Really? Oh, wait. Is this the fucking basement? Oh, so I got on the other side. Man, this game's weird. <laughs> All right, we're gonna start on the other side. I'm gonna go open the door, please. Can't do the restroom, right? Because all the restrooms here are kind of like boarded up. Exam room two, probably closed. Yep. All right, so here we go. Uh oh. Can I help you? This fucking kid. Laura? Huh? You know my name? Eddie told me. That big fat blabbermouth. Damn. I don't know about Mary. <laughs> What's the big deal? Why can't you just tell me? You gotta yell you gotta be a little me shit. No, I won't. I was friends with Mary. We met at the hospital. It was last year. You liar! Damn. Laura, I... Last year, Mary was already... I'm sorry, Laura. Anyway, let's go. We can talk about this later. This is no place for a kid. No place for me, either. There are all sorts of strange things around here. I can't believe you haven't even gotten a scratch on you. Why should I? Damn. Wait, wait. There's something I gotta get. Later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? A letter from Mary. Huh? I wanna go get it. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. You're running to the dark by yourself. Have at it. kid just has fucking keys. Come on, hurry up. Come on, hurry up. Fall into my trap. Yeah, in the back. Oh, man. You're really going to fall for this? What are you doing, Laura? It's further back in the desk. Come on, James. This is the oldest trick in the book. Doing? What a dumbass. Oh, that's not good. Ha, Think. Ha, I tricked you. Thankfully, I have a shock. Why should I? I'm a liar, right? Well, yeah. You just lied again. You proved my point. Huh? Huh? Do ya? What's the magic word? Open it. I think I'll just leave you like this. 
You snotty little brat! Open up! Why, you... you... Laura? You got this! Oh my god. This kid ain't fucking around. the other stuff the hell oh well I guess I'm gonna now yeah okay oh god everything is unexplored oh man I hope I don't have to do everything all over again wait what the hell where am I Quite sure where I'm at, but there we go. No, nope, better heal. I'm just gonna use a full pack because I have no idea what my health is at. I'm not really sure how to measure health in this game. I just know that little status symbol flickers. I have no clue where I'm at. Am I down? Am I in the base? No, I'm not. I guess I should probably go find Maria. She was in what, the third floor? Yeah. So it even lets me use it. Third floor S3. like it. Well, I'm just walking across and pressing X. There are empty medicine bottles here. If this is... Is this what Maria was taking? Is Maria sick now too? Oh, it's the, the same bottles. Okay. So, yeah, I wasn't at the right angle, so I gotta check these again. I just really want to make sure I get all these, make sure I don't miss anything. I think that's all of those. Yes. Okay, so... Good lord, camera.
Oh, I guess I need to go to the roof. That's what I'm going to assume from that, is I need to go to the roof. Of course not. <laughs> uh, second floor it is. <laughs> But I can't. Oh, I need to. Hmm. I may have to look this up. Yeah, I'm kind of stumped here. All right, so let's see here. Yeah, I gotta get back to the elevator. So I need to go back to third floor and get to the second floor. There's some items I'm missing there. Because it's a Silent Hill hospital, it, they make you run around all over the damn place. There we go. And this is three. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> I saw some video of... Uh, I don't know if it was like a test build or something, or Silent Hill 2, or if it was like mods or whatever for PC, but there was a map in the fucking upper right corner, and I was like, that is the dream. <laughs> that is what I want. Because <laughs> I hate that I have to check the map every five seconds. <laughs> I never know where the hell I am in this place. <laughs> Looks like a refrigerator. Open it? Sure. Hmm. Door is too heavy to open by myself. Okay, so I have to have somebody with me. day room. Oh, now it's marking things. That's weird. It wasn't marking stuff before. Um, okay. Way down here. That's not good. <laughs> you got the dry cell battery. You got the basement storeroom key. Okay. Well, that's cool, but I need to be able to get to the other damn side of the basement. <sighs> that's the problem. I'm glad we decided to do this on its own day, because I just had a feeling we were going to be in here fucking forever. All right. Well, now that I have the key... I think now I can actually go into the basement. Or, you know, the game will just tell me to go fuck myself. <laughs> yeah, because I think I have to go to 3 to get to the stairwell, then I can go down. 
because this game is convoluted. <laughs> Oh, yeah. There's a painting of a woman on the door. Oddly enough, the hand part of the painting is actually 3D and sticks out. Sure. <laughs> How did I not notice that before? Uh... Oh, wrong stairwell. All right, I'll be coming back for that later. I better equip a gun. Yep. Okay, sure, I gotta move that. Shotgun shells, perfect. That it? This game has awful, awful cameras. Move the shelf. Yes. No, what does this, this game and things game behind shelves? Ah, Mary? Jesus, FMV. Oh, Maria. <laughs> it's you. I thought you were. Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. He's like, that little shit kid locked me in a room. <laughs> anyway! What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. That ain't my Why problem, didn't lady. Why you try to save me? I didn't hear nothing. What you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You didn't seem scared when you were magically teleporting into rooms. Could you? Lady, no, I've known you I... for like an Just hour. Stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, but she ran away. We've got to find her. You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone, and for some reason, I feel like it's up to me to protect her. Okay. Oh, great. She's back with me. Well, I guess I should probably go back up to three and do the fridge because she's with me now. Um, let me see here. One... Three. Okay. <laughs> Lady. <laughs> like, this game's sense of direction is fucking atrocious. I'm always lost. I never know what direction I'm facing. I guess it's because it's dark. That makes it a lot harder. Because Resident Evil is not even, not this dark at all. I can tell where I'm going. There's landmarks and things like that. And in here, there's just none. Fantasy 
Beyond be worried, they were uh, mentioning you by name. <laughs> Take a left, and just a straight shot. Take a left. God, the camera. Why did they decide to do the camera this way? It's so stupid. <laughs> it's the absolute worst. All right. So. You can't open it? Yeah. Maria, give me a hand here. Come on. You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <clears throat> What's this? Not very cute, is it? Here, James. You take it. Mm, thanks. <laughs> I got the lid ring. Fantastic. Okay. Looks like I stumbled onto a side mission. Uh. But the problem is, like, it's kind of confusing as to where I need to go. Okay, now I gotta go back to three. I think. Got the lead ring. Okay, so now we can prepare, leave the hospital. Wait. I'm supposed to have two rings? Oh my god, I was supposed to go down to the basement. <laughs> uh, this game's pissing me off. The backtracking of this is way worse than Resident Evil, in my opinion. Because Resident Evil actually makes sense. This is just like, what the fuck? <laughs> that I can't use the damn elevator. <laughs> okay. What the hell's down here? Hey, there's a thing. That was seriously it? Okay, so I gotta go back to the door that had the, uh, the hands to get out of it. So that's three. Shut up. <laughs> that stupid door. <laughs> All right. Copper ring. And the hand of the lady in the paint. Okay, that's one. Oh. 
lead ring. I'll just go ahead a little skull inlay on it. Because that makes total sense. What do we got? The fuck? Now where am I? <laughs> Watch it, Maria. I swear to God. Oh. What is this? Go to the ground. Inside is some kind of hard to read writing. I took the director's key, the one to the museum. I hid it behind the praying, the praying woman when I went out for the day trip. I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I'm not a criminal. I hid it behind the praying woman when I went out for the day trip. Okay. Ah, now where am I? This is crazy. I just, I constantly have to check the map. How the hell did I miss this? <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, so this is going to be three one three. Yeah. What the hell is in here? Shotgun shell, shotgun shell, shotgun shell. Oh my god. Ambul, ambul. Wow. That was just... That was just a ton of ammunition. That's awesome. Alright, time to save and I guess we're heading out of the hospital. I'm told they're gonna get ambushed. Yep. What the hell was that? Oh, that's not good. She knows I ain't stopping it. <laughs> Open up. No! Can you lose her? Can she die? Is that supposed to happen? Uh... Well, at least we get some sick ass tunes. <laughs> said um the director's room and because konami's lazy this is following the same fucking <laughs> thing as the first one the director's room was the only one that was open he who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into it himself the truth can only be learned by marching forward follow the map there's a letter and a wrench Are you telling me we're going to Gonzalez's Mexican restaurant? 
Oh, it's in the Rosewater Park again. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. More roaming around. I copied them onto my map. I got the hospital lobby key. Okay. It's that goddamn kid again. I mean, I assume it's going to be that door right there. Oh, was that a save point? There he is dead. I couldn't protect her. Once again, I couldn't do anything to help. Laura has run off somewhere. What should I do? Hmm. Gonna find Mary's the only thing I have left to hope for. Huh. Why did they make that just text? That should have been a cutscene. Alright, everybody. Well shit, we made it through the hospital. <laughs> that was a royal pain in the ass. <laughs> but this is just one of them games, you know, sometimes you got to use a guide. Oh, well. But at least we got through the hospital. I'm not sure if that was supposed to happen with Mary. With, uh, was it Maria? Was that her name? I can't remember. Um, I don't know if that was supposed to happen or not. Or, was, or, was, or it's because I hauled ass out of there. Um, But it's all right. I'm just going to roll with it. I'm not going to worry about the endings and stuff. That's crazy, though. All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and call it for the night. So good shit. Thanks for everybody for hanging out. Uh, if you're watching YouTube in the future, thanks for watching. Um, and yeah, so uh, maybe tomorrow night we'll do some Exo Primal because the new suits dropped. So now there's like 10 fucking suits. <laughs> there's 10 alpha suits. So I got to start grinding out the other suits because um, you get to 20, then you can buy the alpha suits. And they actually play differently and they all look different. So we'll probably be doing that tomorrow. Friday, we're going to probably play uh, some Mortal Kombat. Our buddy Styx has given me another build of the future uh, build that's going to be coming out. Version 1.0 of his revitalized reboot. And we all know that's some good shit. So we'll probably play that for an hour and then switch to Axel Primo and grind out some more suits. We'll just see how things go. Um, so yeah. Probably won't play this again probably until Sunday. So take a little break here and we'll come back refreshed. Everybody take it easy. Have a good one. I will catch y'all next time. Here's the end button.